the tip on your shoulder. Write your lyrics, you can really make the song sound made up. You know, it's not, not made up, but stick together, not in a flow yeah, way. Yeah, you know? yeah, I know what you're saying. It's like different parts. Yeah. This verse you wrote a fucking month ago, yeah, this and, one now, and, and, and there's they don't no go context together. sometimes, you know, it's yeah. just like. I, I'm trying to get rid of that. That's like a bad habit for me because I sometimes get off of the theme of the song and yeah. I just start rapping about shit. But you know, and nowadays, who the fuck cares about lyrics though? But I try to put myself in in the. That's the flow, nice though. Yeah, still, yeah. Right? Therefore, I try to put myself in the middle. I try to put some good meaning in the in my lyrics, and at the same time, I I want to have flow and some new school type of shit so it sounds good and i really work on uh on on, on slangs i really try to uh learn a lot of slangs from usa lingo, yeah. so you can you know you can have this music like you my music would sound more relatable to them because mm. if we take the regular english it's just it's sometimes it's just very lame i feel like it gotcha gotcha There's, what the fuck is Mercabees though Mercabees? yeah it's mercedes benz oh man i don't, I don't know Did they called Mercabees. Mercabees, yeah. yeah i thought it's about the ba i thought yeah. yeah i was like this probably but but Mer i was like nah, maybe it's not maybe something else okay Mercabees is check a it up in our urban urban dictionary <laughs> not doing that <laughs> if you're interested i just no nah, that's nah, cool but uh so what is so if, you, if you're saying that you're like hey i'm trying to get as like to build my vocabulary of this american black hip-hop lingo to you know have more versatile lyrics and so yeah. on and so forth so what is next for ginger man you want to do you you want to you want to go there right you want to break there yeah that's yeah. what you want to do i want to i want my music to sound really like crazy next level like i have some songs already that i i recorded one song funny but i recorded when I was like really fucked up on Xanax, but I Jesus Christ, but you're all doing the same fucking drugs as they do. But <laughs> I recorded this. The song is fucking insane. The best thing about it, I don't remember three days after that. Like, but I like after three days, I came to the studio. Yeah, I put the song on, and we we're like, "What the fuck did we just record?" Like that song is lit as fuck in it's, English, right? Huh? Yeah, yeah, mm. obviously. And it's uh, it's I try to. I don't know, work on my style a little bit and extract from it something new. I want to, I don't know, it's Play just like... Play the guitar. I have songs with guitars already. Already, yeah. that, that's done already. Uh... I just I'm I'm just I'm, I'm just trying to find that my style, you know. Yeah, I think it's uh, yeah, because I think that's that's what I when you you know when you watch these rapper interviews like the Breakfast Club, you know, yeah, probably yeah, right, obviously. Right, obviously, yeah. And all that type of shit. And I recently saw Vince Staples interview on Power 106 because he had this new project thing out yeah. the FM. Yeah. Listen to it? No, not yet. No. But it's some really songs. Nice, man. I I've heard some songs, yeah. yeah. And he said that for the first like when he got in the studio uh and he had he knew mac miller back then rest in peace mac miller he knew earl sweatshirt you probably know uh, yeah no yeah and uh and that was sid sid the kid from the internet i hope it's them but anyways and he got in the studio he said that for the first two or three years they were just helping they were just telling him what to rap they yeah. were just telling him how to rap it. He said his tonality was terrible. He said that he got actually decent in like two, three years. And like and and the the biggest thing why he you know why he continues that he actually just knew the right music people. He just, that's that's it. So do you feel like you still haven't found your voice? I feel like I'm, like I'm your on the signature. Path. I'm, yeah. I feel mm. I'm I'm on a path that I have my I have my signature already. Little little like it's already somewhere like written down that people when they listen to my music they hear and and they know that this is ginger main mm. but i feel like i have much more to go much more to have in my way a lot of different like styles and i just try to perfectionize it like like to make it just really really different mm. so i can stand out you know and you know maybe conquer the world conquer the world <laughs> <laughs>